answer the following questions. Number one, will I study her reaction to know who is a good man? You need to project. Will I study her reaction? A man must ask himself, physically, mentally, and emotionally, and encourage her to confine her hopes and dreams to me. Are you capable that a woman can look at you and tell you, these are my inspiration. You have created a platform. You, the girl is so confident to tell you a lot of stars. Number two, will I always demonstrate my affection, not expecting her to take my love for granted? There is a way a man must carry himself. And you can be jovial, but nobody can take it for granted. You can't disrespect me. I will finish you. I'm sorry. I will laugh, will joke, but you must build a personality in a way, the way you carry yourself, jovial, very social, but nobody can take your love and your personality for granted. Men must ask themselves this question. Will I try to see things from her perspective as well as my own to avoid becoming set in my ways? It's either my way or no other way. That is especially a choleric individuals. No, like TK means, no, calm down. She's a human being with a head. Listen to her too. Can I lead interesting discussions of important issues without it ending in an argument? A man must develop the capacity to do this. If we do have a misunderstanding or a pervish outburst of irritation, will I put it behind us settling the difficulty one way or the other? Or will I sulk upon inviting the problems to return? Always guilt stripping. No. No. That is a road, a red flag or a red story building. Will I make allowances for irritability brought about through overtiredness and a build up of little house annoyances, pretending not to notice it? Like I told you, your daughter will pour the soup down and you are in and she's giving you attitude. No, you need to know that something is wrong somewhere. Can you handle this? without it turning into a fight again. Will I inspire her and take an interest in her hobbies and in her more ambitions, ambitious ventures that are necessary for her happiness? Some men are threatened by the advances and the progress of a woman. God created her with a star, with a, with, 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 with a certain unique impact she must make in the world. Don't become an enemy. And because of your weak personality, you want to rob her down and dim her life. Allow her. You may have a first degree. She may have a PhD, but she must respect. There is a way to handle it, and it can be fine. Don't. Will you be that husband to our daughters? Will I take an interest in her clothes? Show her my appreciation and pay her the little compliments and the attention that I did in our courting days. All the men are telling her the nice things. And only you, they must beg and make an altar call before you say for once, this attire is nice. Which man are you? Will her life be enriched? Her interest broaden? And her happiness and general well-being increased by marrying me? Can this lady you want to date or marry, can she become better just by marrying you? Number 10 for the men, the last one. Will I keep loving her? As the years roll by and changes of childbirth become glaring and age having its toll on her. She used to have a flat tummy. Project after four or five kids or three. When the breast is now dropping, the stomach is now different. Sir, will you still love this girl? That is looking like a rose flower today. 